Hi everyone, welcome back to the Blackwell Legacy. Now, in the previous episodes, as I'm sure you saw, I got completely stuck and had no idea what to do. And I don't want to waste your time with just going back to places I've been trying to find new things to do, so what I'm going to do is cut out in just a second, and then um, look around the environment. I'm just going to go to the places I've been before and see if I can find a solution on my own. And if I do, then I will cut back to there. And if I can't find a solution, then I'm going to look at a walkthrough. So either way, I will be back soon with some progress. So be right back. Hmm. The school thought that Adrian was a girl because of his name. Alex could also be a girl's name. I wonder. Wait, did I just find it? Alex Davenport? Did I just make progress just by randomly trying to find connections in the stuff in my notebook? If I did, then woohoo! That was an interesting noise. Maybe with the new name of Alex Davenport, I can use that to get in to see Susan? Let's give it a shot. Excuse me, guard, whose image in the top right corner is at a very strange angle. What is it, up or down? I'd like to see Susan Lee, please. I told you. It's up. You're not Look at on his the guest jutting list. chin. Just, oh, well. That's such a weird that's position. That's because. That's because of the system. Blame Susan. I wasn't on the list at the time. I should be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, really? Well, let, what was your. My name was Alex Davenport. My name is Alex Davenport. Huh. Your name is on the what list. What do you know? Can I go in now? Sure. I'll notify the nurse that you're coming. She'll take you in. Thanks. So, before when I said Alexander Davenport, he didn't think like, Oh, maybe your name's down wrong? It's Alex? I mean, really, what are the chances? Anyway, Alexander? hey, Susan. Alexander? Um, no. I'm sorry. Where's Alexander? Um, I'm gonna tell the truth. He's not here. They told me... they told me he was coming. Yeah, I'm sorry, but I... It's okay. He doesn't want to see me anyway. Who are you? My name is Rosangela. I'd like to talk to you if that's okay. Are you a doctor? Oh, wait, I just realized what happened. The person's name isn't actually supposed to be a woman's name, it's just that the guard doesn't realize that it's actually a man. Because it can be a man or a woman. Right? Is that... Is that right? I, I don't know. Whatever. I'm confused. What was her question? Am I a doctor? I think that was her question. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm playing the game, right? I'm totally paying attention. Um, I think she said, are you a doctor? And I'm not, so since I'm going to tell the truth, no. No, I'm not a doctor. Okay, But good. I'd still like to talk to you if that's okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's a bit dubious. Um, I would be too. I'm gonna ask how she's doing. So how are you feeling? Fine. That's all. Yeah, I'm fine. Whatever. Okay, that went well. She doesn't know me, so it's not surprising. Let's ask about Joanne first. I'd like to talk to you about your friend Joanne. You know Joanne? Sort of. What, what about her? Can you tell me about her? She's Joanne. That's all. Oh, thank you. That was helpful. I've met a lot of helpful people in this game. Do you know why Joanne killed herself? Susan? She just did. Don't know why. Also very helpful. Do you know Joanne's roommate, Kelly? Yeah, sorta. Why? Oh, no reason. Do you know what happened to Allie? Yeah. Do you know why she did it? No. She doesn't know much, does she? Susan, can you tell me why you're here? What happened? Nothing. Just... nothing. Sure, then nothing happened and that's why you tried to kill yourself and ended up in the hospital. Yep, that makes sense. Susan, can you listen to me? You're not crazy. I know what happened. 
You summoned the deacon with a Ouija board. No, that didn't really happen. Susan, you don't have to pretend. I believe you. You do? Whatever happened, I believe you. He still comes to me. The drugs keep him away during the day, but when I sleep, he enters my head and he won't stop screaming. Ugh. I thought I was crazy, but Joanne and Allie, how could it happen to all three of us? It's impossible. No, it's not. No, it's not. The deacon is real? I believe so, yes. Are you here to help me? I'm going to try. Thank God. I was ready to die here, but... I know. Can I ask you some questions about what happened? Sure. Ask whatever you want. Alright. I'm gonna ask about Alex. She said that he wouldn't want to see me. Why? Can you tell me anything about Alex? Alex was my boyfriend, I guess. But since I came here, he won't see me anymore. Just as well. The jerk. Yeah, what an asshole. So what happened to you, Susan? What did the deacon do to you? The same thing he did to the others. Got into my head and just wouldn't keep quiet. It was just so noisy inside my head. I had to do something. I saw the speeding taxi, and I just... Well, you know, here I am. Were you hurt? No. The driver hit the brakes in time. The taxi missed me completely. Then the stupid cop on the corner dragged me here. I can't even kill myself right. How sad. I've got a helper. I guess I go back over the questions now that she's willing to answer. Can you tell me anything about Joanne? Joanne wanted to save the world, but she couldn't even save her friends. After Allie went, Joanne couldn't take it. She blames herself, but it's not her fault. I don't blame her for it. Any of it. It was only luck that I ended up here and didn't die. Do you know why Joanne killed herself? Yes. The deacon. He got in our heads. His voice keeps pleading, babbling. Nothing shuts him up. Just keeps going. I just wanted quiet. Peace and quiet. That's why Joanne jumped off the roof. She was willing to give anything to just keep him quiet. Even her life. Was Kelly involved in any of this? Kelly? Joanne's roommate? Yeah. No. She always left when we came over. She didn't like us much. But that's okay. We didn't like her either. Well, that fits what uh, I heard from Kelly. Can you tell me about Allie? Allie. Oh, I miss her so much. The sweetest, funniest person in the world. You couldn't help but smile with her around. She was always dragging us out on some adventure. She was so... Different. Every other girl had pictures of boys on their walls. She had pictures of dogs. She loved dogs. She was studying to be a vet to take care of them. And now she can't. She... She was the first of us to go. Why is that? How come the strongest of us was the first to break down? God, such a great group of people. These three people, and now, now they're just... Destroyed. There's only one left. But hopefully I can save her at least. One's better than none. We've already established this. I don't need Okay, good point. Good point. <laughs> That's what the hint says. She was very fond of dogs when she was alive. Hmm. Are they hinting at something? Perhaps I should click this? Can you tell me anything else about Allie? No. Only that wherever she is, I hope there are dogs around. Well, yes and no. You see, she seems to be a ghost at the dog walk park, so kinda? She can scare the dogs. I don't think that's exactly what she wants to do with her life, so I don't know how good that is. 
Okay, do I have enough now? I might have enough, actually, to help her. Let me make sure I've already asked these. Can you tell me again what happened? Same thing that happened to- I tried to kill myself, and now I'm- Alright. Can you tell me- Nothing important. We had a thing. It's done now. We've already all asked that. So Kelly- No. Can you tell me- For quiet, the deacon's voice inside her head. I think I have everything, yeah. I have to go now, Susan. But I'll come back to check on you again. Mm-hmm. Hmm, she seemed dubious. Look, Joey, it's starting to get dark. Yeah, I can see that. Was it the darkness that gave it away? <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> oh, Joey. He's so crazy. Nice music. Is this foreshadowing? Storms coming, the song says. I have a feeling that's foreshadowing. Alright, to the park we go. At night. Do I have any things in my notebook? Can I connect that? I don't see how. There is obviously a connection between the... Nope, I think that's it. Alright, let's give this a shot. Come on, Ali Mondigo. Let's talk to that ghost again, Joey. Yeah, sure. Hey there. Remember me? No. Maybe. Um, I'll get right to the questions. Can you tell me anything about yourself, Allie? Allie Montego, a story and song. She kisses a boy. Oh, I guess I don't have any new questions for her, do I? Did you summon some- Did I? That's why I'm- I hate those things. Okay, I've already done this. Oh, and skip, skip, skip. The, the I I I oh. Okay. Don't worry, we'll- Look, just- We'll figure- Okay, let me try that again without asking questions because I don't need to. Let's talk to that- Yeah. Hey there. No. Well, I'm not gonna avoid this subject, so I guess I'll just go easy on her. Can you tell me the last thing you remember? Candy. I was eating candy. Candy? Candy to make the deacon go away. Ah. I think I understand. Did it work? I don't hear him anymore, but he did something to me. They'll go away. Hmm. Wait, is this just back to the questions? How do I... how do I do this? Isn't this just gonna go over... Isn't this just gonna go over questions that I've already done? Tell me again about Joanne. Beware of Joanne when her plans unfurled. Do you know... Joanne? She, she's going to change... she's not... even though they all have because... Can you tell me anything else about Kelly? Kelly, Kelly. Did you summon something? Yeah, that, no, I've already done that. The di- the, I, I, Damn. Don't worry. Do you know when he- On a date with- Wasn't- Do you know- Oops. Wasn't, if I, what, what am I supposed to do? These are just questions. This isn't gonna help her. I need to convince her that she's dead. How do I do that? Look, just- We'll figure- Okay, well I've gone easy on her. I've gone straight to the question. So now I'll just avoid the subject? Please note, dog. Hmm. Whoops. Let's talk. Yeah. All right, a third try. Hey there. No. Oh, that's my only one. My only option now. You're a little out of sorts. How do you feel? Lonely. Sometimes, the deacon made me lonely. Got into my head. Made everyone go away. What? What? Do I have to do something else? And if so, what the hell do I have to do? This is confusing. Can you tell me? 
Yeah, 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 all right. Look, just... We'll f okay. What the hell do I do now? Maybe, let me talk to Joey. Joe, shh, try, you never know who... All right, let's go back to our apartment. I mean, really, what more information do I need? 